So what is up, YouTube? We are back. Um, we're here with... Sorry. Not funny. No, you're good. <clears throat> we're here with another Adam's Polishes video, like we promised you guys. So just recently on Instagram, uh, Gus follows them, of course. I just recently started following them. But they have a, cl a clear mystery bucket. And... Really? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Um, so yeah, they always have some mystery stuff going on. Uh, we've taken advantage of quite a few of them, uh, but this is going to be our first time with a clear mystery bucket. Um, the price was $79.99 .99, and it was only available on their website. So this time we actually did an order through Amazon. It was through the actual website. I was able to get free shipping though with a few things that we added extra on to that. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and take it out of the box and then just show you just how it looks from the outside, okay? So you guys can keep watching. So here you go. I'm polishes, clear mystery bucket, stacked all the way to the top. And go ahead and stay tuned. Uh, Gus is gonna go ahead and start taking out all the contents to see what we got. Only thing though, should we tell them now or should we tell them in the end? Well, I'll tell them that. Yeah, you can tell them. So we're very disappointed because we're all excited about it. The only reason why we got the bucket was because obviously it comes with a great guard and it's missing. How could they forget to <laughs> place it? Yeah, um, so that's the second time. So the first time I surprised Gus with the Valentine's Day gift, I got him the, tier, the tire and wheel kit and uh well i had some shipping issues with them and now this so let's see what they can do to make up for it because shoot we love the product we love them but they're kind of slacking a little bit when it comes to getting our stuff ordered so stay tuned guys uh, what is up youtube it's gus here <laughs> uh yeah like ruby said we got adam's uh mystery bucket so uh this is our like clear see-through one they have like another one um one of the reasons why we wanted the uh, the bucket is because the bucket that I have that has my grid guard uh, from like all the pressure and everything, it literally like cracked in half right here. So I just put some duct tape on it because I don't want to buy another bucket. So that's what we've been working with. So this is the reason why we bought this was because of the grid guard and because of the bucket. We're like perfect. And then plus we got amazing shit. So starting off, we got microfiber wheel and wash mitt. Never used one of these, never kind of been interested, but uh, I guess we will be using that. We got Stegel Soft Polishing Towel. We got one of those. And then another thing that we also needed was another microfiber wash mitt. So Adams came in clutch, hooked it up. So we were kind of stoked about that. So the, the items that we bought separate that do not, that were not included in the bucket would be these two right here. So we bought coating prep and we bought iron remover. So this was not included in the bucket. We bought this separate. All right, so starting off in the bucket, we got leather conditioner, 16 ounce. This is, this actually works really good. If you follow me on Instagram, you will see that uh, I recently had a job and uh, I uh, cleaned and conditioned the leather seats and uh, you can really see the difference and it came out pretty amazing. Next is uh, Ultra Foam Shampoo. We actually have like about one more use of this uh, in our previous 16 out, so it's kind of cool that we got a, a refill. Not good, and then we do also have the other soap. We got a 16 ounce of detail spray and I'm not gonna lie. Stuff smells amazing. Even Ruby says it. Yeah. Uh, we did have the mystery. Were you detail. trying to let everybody else smell it or what? Yeah, I know. Like, I thought fucking YouTube they could smell through and shit. I don't know what the hell they thought of VR and shit. For people that do know that have this and have used it, they know what smell they're smelling. Well, they know what smell whenever I went. You know, um, works excellent. No issues. Tire shine. We are stacked up on hella tire shine. We have tire shine for days. Like literally, we have like about like three years worth of tire shine right now. And came with this two ounce, uh, like I guess like sample or something, I don't know, of uh, Ultra Foam shampoo. 
Which I wasn't really kind of excited about that, only because we got a 16 ounce. So why do we need another two ounce? You know, like it could have like we could have got like a wash and wax or regular shampoo or something else. You know, it would have been nice. Adam, if you're watching, go right through. And then we got a uh, ceramic boost, which we were actually looking at. Uh, hopefully, hopefully getting inside the bucket. And if we didn't, we're gonna purchase it uh, separate because we uh, do need that for the ceramic coat coming up. And then we got a sticker, and then we just got a 25% off on our next purchase on uh, shampoo, like before March something. But again, the reason why we bought the bucket, one of the reasons was for a grid garden. As you can see, there's no goddamn grid garden there. So we were disappointed on that. And if we all like, oh, chicken and books, looked in the box, nothing in there. So yeah, uh, forgot the grid, uh, grid box. So uh, grid box, grid guard. So uh, me and Ruby are gonna do some math, and we're gonna tell you what it all comes out to, and then we'll tell you if it's worth it or not. So stay tuned. Cool. All right, guys. So we don't feel like doing math right now, so we're not gonna do math, and uh, we're just gonna give like our honest opinion on it. Now, we are disappointed on the grid guard because it's not in here again. So we are kind of let down by that, but as in, was it worth it? Honestly, with everything that we already have, I want to say it sort of wasn't worth it. The reason why is we're already stacked up on tire shine. I have a shit ton of soap already. Detail spray I really don't use. Leather conditioner was something that we uh, that uh, I was thinking about purchasing, so I'm kind of glad I did. And then another thing was ceramic boost. So putting these two things here is something that we did need. Detail spray, I'm not really like a big detail spray person, but again, it is, it was included, so you know, it's something that I have very little of, so you know, I will put it in there. We did need a microfiber uh, wash mitt, so that came in clutch. The towel, uh, Paul, we already have like, we really have like a bundle of polishing towels, so it's kind of, you know, it really wasn't kind of worth it for us. And then the wheel wash mitt, I have like every accessory for the, the, for the wheels, so it was kind of like, I got like the very last piece, so it's kind of like, you know, it's like, eh, you know, it's sort of. And then, this honestly was nah. I'm not gonna lie. This was kind of worthless. Not gonna lie, Adam. If you're watching this, I don't mean to step on your shoes or be an asshole or anything, but this was kind of not the best thing to put in there. I'm not gonna lie, because that's a. It's basically a sample size, and like basically that's it. So from my standpoint, I want to say this time around, I want to say it wasn't worth it. Ruby, do you want me to uh, flip the camera on you? Well, no, not really. Um, just, I guess to end this, um, it's a good mystery bucket for those who maybe are starting off. Yes, perfect. That's what it is. Now, for people who, for the most part, always buy Adam's Polishes stuff, from all the mystery stuff that we've done so far, I think the items are repetitive. So, I'm not sure. I just... I think it was okay. It was an okay buy. It wasn't. It wasn't the greatest, and it wasn't the worst. Um, again, stuff that we needed. I think the best one that we so far have. I think we got, you know, the value for our buck was the uh, trunk, trunk organizer. organizer. That, that one, one, that one, that yeah, one, killed that it. That one clutch as hell. Because it's like it had a variety. So that's just all I'm gonna say. And then another thing was is that we bought the trunk organizer when we really didn't have a lot of Adams products. So that one came in really clutch. And like she like just to uh, reiterate what she said, uh, if you're new, you know you don't have a lot of detail and stuff. This is perfect for you, you know, because you get a little bit of everything. So it's it's perfect for you. But for someone that you know has you know pretty stocked up and stuff and looking for other stuff, you know you're taking a 50 50 chance. That's why it's called mystery. And unfortunately on this time, didn't get the grid guard. So that was kind of like fuck, you know. And then also we did get a couple of stuff that we already have. So it was kind of, this time it kind of was, in my opinion, I, I don't want to say it was a fail. It just, it didn't live up to the expectation that we were kind of looking at. 
you know, from my standpoint. Ruby? Same. So, uh, that's in conclusion of the Adams uh, Mystery 2019 bucket. Um, I will let y'all know if we do get uh, in touch with Adams to see, you know, what's up with the grid guard or, you know, how, what, like, how that gets solved or whatever. But uh, I'll probably do that, like, in the next video whenever I do, like, a video on their stuff. But uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope this gave out a lot of information to y'all. And Adam, I hope you're watching. That's twice you messed up, Adam. That's twice. But we still loyal. You know, we still buy new stuff. We're good. So, uh, hope you guys enjoy the video. Like, comment, subscribe, share. Follow me on Instagram to see uh, the, the finished products of what these products do and how they work and so forth. And uh, we're out. Peace.